Hi guys, we are going to the protest. We'll see what's gonna happen there. This is my friend. Everybody, I would say, is feeling kind of anxious, but still a lot of people support what's going on because there is a lot of propaganda on media. We almost don't have any independent media right now, uh, so yeah, we'll see what we can do. But I think it's important not to, you know, lose uh, hope and still do something. We are not allowed to go further, to go to the actual place where the protest is supposed to be happening, which is like very strange because, I mean, why why can't we go where we want to go, you know? This is what living in Russia is like. There is not a lot of people at all, uh, plus it's very hard to get through to the place where it's like the protest is supposed to start. Maybe more people will come later, I don't know. Um, they also are bringing more and more buses, uh, which is like for arrested people, and they blocked the pass to the actual place. <laughs> Задача такая, чтобы сразу быстренько из литровка выходит, я так понимаю просто, и смотрят, наверное, каких-то таких активных или способных на действия сразу выявляют и быстренько их сразу. If we are at the place where everything is supposed to be happening, but it's almost no one here. It's empty. There is not a lot of people at all. Like, I, I, I don't know. So obviously I'm home now. There was not a lot of people. Unfortunately, I will not say what I think about it. Uh, but if you know me, you know what my views are. But I'm not allowed to share them anymore because of the new laws. But anyway, there was not a lot of people at all. But actually, after coming back home and talking to some of my friends online, I found out that there was a crowd that managed to like gather and move, but they moved a different path, not that one that was announced. I don't know why they moved a different direction. Maybe because the the road was blocked, as I've shown you on the video too. But my friend, who was actually there on this path, uh, could send me some videos. So you will see them after my little speech here. And why there was not a lot of people, I think there are several reasons. Uh, first reason is that everybody pretty much got arrested immediately. It was even like hard to start something and get the message across. Uh, and probably the second reason is that some of the people are already arrested like on the days before and a lot of people went to different countries. So yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed my video and hopefully more to follow. Нет войне! Нет войне! Нет войне! Нет войне! Нет войне! Нет войне! Нет войне!